and it is for the World Heavyweight Championship! Main event, Jey Uso. Yeah, it's just him, Uso. Not content with being the right hand anymore, Jey Uso has set out on his own path. And it's a particularly treacherous path these days. There are a lot of men who have a grudge with his actions in the bloodline that are not easily forgotten. Jey Uso is intent on proving himself to those competitors in the entire WWE Universe. The entire WWE Universe on their feet from Jey Uso. Well, it sounds like this entire arena agrees that this is indeed the main event. The Judgment Day is here. Everyone in their way is doomed. The Judgment Day growing more dominant every single night, and their accolades grow with every match. Now, this is a group that's almost impossible to prepare for. The Judgment Day plans for every scenario, always having each other's back. But they create chaos. And Judgment Day thrives in chaos. Introducing the challenger from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 242 pounds, main event, Jay Uso! And his opponent from New York City, weighing in at 249 pounds, the World Heavyweight Champion, Damien! That's what these men are going to war over. The World Heavyweight Championship. One more look at the ultimate prize. The reason for all those long training hours. We know the stakes. World Heavyweight Championship will go around the waist of tonight's winner. The energy in the arena is palpable. Goosebumps are tingling throughout my body, Michael. We know our combatants must have butterflies in their stomachs. Well, nerves need to steady, and these competitors need to bring their A game if they hope to leave with the World Heavyweight title. The energy in this building is palpable. A rope step to make on Hilo! Throwing all costs into the wind and leaping to the outside. Bam! Down he goes. Jay looking powerless to every attack. 
Yeah, but Uso's just one move from turning this around. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. He climbs into the ring. Up and around. Tilt the world slam. And what a reversal from Jey Uso. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Elbow drop. Count for the size and strength of Damian Priest. Usually, speed works against folks the size of Priest, but Damian has agility on his side, too. I'd say Priest's current weakness is his unchecked aggression. While it has led him to victories, it also leaves him open to making mistakes. Not very often, mind you, but it does happen. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. And Priest's size and agility is negated as he faltered there. Jay's confidence really showed in that maneuver. Looking wobbly in the corner. Gotta hurt. Focusing on a body part, picking it apart. The arm's as good of a place to focus as any. No escape from these punches. Jay is imposing his will. Priest's aggression has backfired thus far, and the opposition is capitalized. Going for a pin for the championship. And the champion gets a shoulder up just before two. Close call, but not enough yet. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. He might get caught. Elbow drop right on point. Off the rope to the outside, Tope con Hilo. Took a massive risk, but it might have paid. Oh, God. I oh, had that well scouted. Caught with a neck breaker. Gentlemen, in the interest of self preservation, I may have to excuse myself. Saxton, you hang tight. Let this play out. The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. Phew, that was close. DDT! Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. The champ looking worn out. That's just the kind of thing main event. Uso. Uso splashed by Jay. The champ's eyes look glazed over. There's two. Just feel it. Their championship dream has become reality. To go from challenger to champion. That has to feel good. Unless you're the one going from champion to nothing.